time for Monsters Pepper Reviews. What's up everybody, it's Bootla Bobby back with another Monsters Pepper Review. Today we have the third and final salsa from 1893 Salsa. This is Blueberry Hill. The jar says, a wonderful combination of blueberry and bacon will make this your favorite salsa. You will find your thrill on Blueberry Hill with this unique blend of, of original salsa flavors with a modern twist. The ingredients on this are water, tomatoes, dried blueberries, lime juice, bacon, cilantro, tomato paste, jalapenos, vinegar, habaneros, cornstarch, sugar, garlic, sea salt, and McCormick Italian seasoning. Let's go ahead and get into this. I apologize for the camera lag. Go ahead and stir it up. Give this a fair shot. Okay, I smell cilantro. I smell onions. I smell the, the savory saltiness from the bacon. I smell a little bit of tomatoes in there, not much. Um, I smell some more sweetness that um, it's not from the habaneros, so I'm assuming it's from the uh, sugar and the blueberries. Let's go ahead and get into this. It does have a, a sweet but yet uh, barbecuey, salty savoriness to it. All right, guys, down the hatch. It's really, it's got, it's like the perfect combination of savory and salty with the sweetness behind it. Um, tastes really good. I don't taste tomatoes. I do taste onions. I taste the bacon. I taste blueberries, cilantro, lime juice, um, jalapenos. You get just a little bit of, just very minimal tingly on the back of your throat to let you know that it's got hot peppers in it um, now the flavor I absolutely love my issue is it's not exactly a thick chunky salsa I really wished that it was thicker and chunkier but I do enjoy the flavor quite a bit now as far as like would I use this for just you know salsa and chips Probably not. Like I say, I'm not a gigantic fan of the consistency of this. Now, I can imagine a lot of recipes this would go great in. And I'm really enjoying it. Like I say, I mean, I can sit here with a spoon and eat it and be quite content. However, as far as uh, salsa, I just, I'm not a fan of the consistency of this. Um... It's just too thin and uh, watery for me. But, if, you know, you can get past that, the flavor on this is really great. Uh, with that being said, guys, I will put a link in the description where you can pick this up. Have a good one. We'll see you in the next video, guys.